Hey, it's Poppy, and I'm getting ready to take you guys with me into the beauty supply warehouse. Are you ready for this, people? I am ready. I'm very excited. Um, you know, I've cut my hair about two weeks ago, and and we'll admit that, you know, I've become a bit of a product junkie. So today, the plan is to not go too crazy, but um, honestly, I'm just, there are a few products that I've heard about that I'd like to, like, check out, but I'd also just want to see what they kind of offer and what they have for natural hair. So I'm going to go in and take a look around and see what I can find. Are you ready? Let's go. So we're finally back from our visit to the beauty supply warehouse. Let me show you guys what I bought. Um, so one thing I bought that I've been hearing a lot about is, and I actually didn't buy it at the beauty supply warehouse, but just after that I went to a grocery store and bought it, is apple cider vinegar. I've been hearing a lot about um, washing your hair with this or doing like a rinse with this, um, that it, it helps to define your curls. I also got this wide tooth comb. Um, I've heard a lot of people talk about the fact that, you know, um, yeah, just don't want to use like a regular comb on your hair. You don't want to like kill your curls. So um, when I co-wash my hair during the week, I'm using this to really kind of go through and comb my hair completely through. So that's in my shower. I bought these lovelies, which are like hot oil treatments. I, I was really trying to find just kind of like straight jojoba oil or jojoba, whatever it's called. Um, castor oil is another thing I've heard really good about, um, really good things about that, that it helps your hair to grow. So, um, But I, I'll be honest, I was trying to find just kind of pure oil, um, and they didn't really have anything at the beauty supply warehouse, which was kind of amazing because that place was huge. But they didn't have anything that was just pure oil there. Um, but they did have these, um, and they are really close to just pure. So, like, for example, this vitamin E oil has some other oils in it. It's got, like, sweet almond oil, lemon oil, wheat germ oil, grapeseed oil, jojoba oil, um, and some rosemary extract for fragrance. Um, so I was okay with that. So I actually used this for my um, deep conditioner um, hot oil treatment this week. I used about half of the tube, which, you know, my hair's pretty short, so that'll last until my hair grows, and then it'll be more than that, but I literally, I paid 99 cents for these, so, um, it's really cool, because they say on the front what they do, so vitamin E oil aids stronger, longer, and healthier hair, so we got that, we got some carrot and aloe oil, um, some olive oil for moisture, and then some raw shea butter oil, so, um, we'll be using these every two weeks, we're going to do a hot oil treatment, so, bought those. Okay. I've been hearing a lot about this gel, this Echo Gel. So this, I bought this one. This is the um, olive oil styling gel. Um, I've heard really good things about it in that it doesn't, um, it doesn't get flaky or hard. I know people use gel for their twist outs and bantu knots and things like that. So I did go ahead and purchase some of this. And then the shampoo that I was talking about. I've been hearing a lot about the Shea Moistures line. So I bought the... Um, this is the Organic Raw Shea Butter Moisture Retention Shampoo. And so I bought this. I've heard great things about this, um, that the products, it's organic, the ingredients are, are, are organic. And I, I know a lot of people who kind of try to go by the curly girl method, um, who don't shampoo regularly, do use this at least once, maybe twice a month. So that's kind of what, you know, my plan is right now, to shampoo my hair with this shampoo at least twice a month basically is what I'm thinking every two weeks when I do my hot oil treatment and then <laughs> okay one other thing this is my um, I didn't really need to buy it but it was something I've been hearing about and it was kind of one of those things that I did like for the future you know like my hair is gonna grow longer and one day I'm gonna get to use this product when I'm doing my twist outs and stuff and it's the Cantu Shea Butter um, leave-in conditioner repair cream um, I've heard a lot of things about this and a lot of people uh, use this to do their twist outs with is what I've heard. Um, so I went ahead and like I said in, oh it smells really good. This will be something that I'll be using maybe more in the future but I bought it because it was only five dollars and I just thought hey why not we'll buy for the future. Thanks so much for watching you guys. Um, I'd love it if you would subscribe if you are interested in kind of following me on my journey. Also if you you know thought this was halfway entertaining maybe you'd like to go ahead and click that like button down there that might be awesome. Um, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.